morning challengers it is day six I thought I'd give us a quick video today I'm literally out here walking in the gardens um, around my condo um, and I had a thought for us all today and that is this that um, in, a, in a challenge like we're doing it's very short it's very intense and then it's done but it's just one little segment in um, the course of our whole entire lives right our physical fitness you know aspect of our lives and our spiritual lives our emotional lives I wanted to challenge us today to be motivated by love, love from God, love from other people, and even self-love, which sounds a little nutty sometimes to Christians, but um, have to care for yourself and love yourself and respect yourself enough because of, uh, because of this. If you don't, you will self-sabotage every single time. You'll find a way to make yourself not succeed at this. Okay, so <clears throat> what we might have to do today is quell some of the emotions, quell the or deal with the emotions, quell the, the voices that tell us that we can't do this. Maybe even some of the influences of other people around us. Hey, it's the holidays, and it can be really hard to stay on track. Um, and if we get off track, we get back on track, okay? But let's focus on God's love for us today, our love for um, each other, our support of each other, and not fall into the self self-sabotage self trap, which is, of course, motivated by shame, okay? And that doesn't have any part of this group and really shouldn't have any part of our lives. When we deal with issues, we deal with them and we move on with forgiveness and love. We don't uh, wallow in shame, okay? So some of us have uh, really big goals. Some of us have gotten here to the place that we are because we've let ourselves get out of control. <clears throat> we've let ourselves go a lot, okay? We haven't focused on ourselves and our <clears throat> health at all. <clears throat> Excuse me, and sometimes that's because we tell ourselves that we're loving other people and you know we don't want to be selfish but you know what you have to have a level of self-care the scriptures speak of um, carrying <clears throat> your own load but bearing other people's burdens so that load that sort of that uh, stuff that's in your own backpack that's your responsibility and that involves your physical life your emotional life and your spiritual life all right so let's lean into that today uh, love you guys love this group and love this challenge okay I'll talk to you later bye